Hello, hello, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. In the previous episode, we uh, trounced another one of the Valuan Admirals in aerial combat and chased him back here to the sacred mountain that the Valuans are currently occupying. Uh, this door has been welded shut. It looks like they're serious about keeping the Ixatakans in here. Yes, well, unfortunately for them, uh, this door is wide open, so we're just gonna waltz right on in and free all of those Ixatakans. How about that, huh? It's probably the right thing to do. Ah, uh, back to the creepy music, huh? Oh. Uh-oh, I think we stepped on some kind of switch. Hmm, well, it doesn't look like anything happened. It was probably nothing. Yeah, probably. Ooh, and what's this? It's Alfonso, oh goody. Well, DeLoco, I've heard that the air pirates have crossed the South Ocean and they are on their way here. Yes, I ran into them north of Hortica. They, uh, narrowly escaped my flame cannon. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, fighting air pirates is a bit more difficult than burning down trees, but I guess you already know that. Vice was responsible for my demotion. I will make sure he suffers, and I will prove to the world that I am Valua's greatest admiral. Soon, Galshin will be taking orders from me. I simply don't understand why someone as noble as myself is forced to take orders from anyone other than Empress Theodora herself. Well, DeLoco, I must be going. I have to exterminate some pests. Ah, how dramatic. Idiot. <laughs> yeah, uh, DeLoco is not impressed. Perhaps you should have stared into the mirror a bit longer this morning. I think you have a hair out of place. As for you, Vice, you damaged my precious chameleon. You will pay for that. Oh, yes, you will pay. The next time we meet will be the last. Oh, and there go the lights. Someone just set off the alarm. I wonder who it could be. Well, three guesses. Two of them don't count. Oh, my, my. Ah, oh, Vice, how nice of you to drop by. You saved me the trouble of finding you. Yes, I know that you are searching for the moon crystals as well. You must be trying to rescue Isapa. <laughs> good, good. You see, Vice, these mines are full of traps. Too bad for you. You can't escape, Vice. You will never leave these mines alive. And there go the doors. Well, it looks like something happened. Oh, uh, the exit just closed by itself. I don't know about you guys, but I've got a bad feeling about this place. Yeah. Well, anyway, uh, this... Does this door open? No, it won't open. Looks like it's locked. I think that's actually the way out. Oh, and the doors close behind us again. Oh. And... Cupel is already yelling at me. Oh, there's a big shutter. Doesn't look like it's gonna open. Uh, Cupel? Hmm. Oh, here it is. I got a cham. Okay, head on over to the items. Where is it? Where is it? Cham. To Cupel. Will he evolve? Yes! Oh, hooray! We get a new cupel to play with. Uh, whenever we battle something. Let's see, we've got carts full of dirt running down there. Uh, which way do we go? Is there anything up here? The other way looks like the way forward. So this... Hmm. O-X-O. One of these is different, and that is the right one. Okay. Come on, DeLoco, you can come up with better traps than that. But who are we gonna fight? These ought to be new enemies.
And it's just a bunch of bats and a slime! And one of these loopers. Okay, so first things first. Actually, you know, they're facing the other way. Ah, it doesn't matter. Get rid of the looper. Uh, you can attack a bat, you can attack a bat, and you can attack a bat. Remember, the good thing about special moves is that they don't miss. So it's probably the best way to get rid of enemies like loopers, which tend to dodge your attacks. Ah, so Cupel is no longer a cone that flies at them like a bullet. Uh, he is now a larger sword than he was previously. Miss? Come on, Drachma. You can do better than that. Uh, however, yeah, these, these enemies are nothing. Get out of here. Yeah, nothing to it. Okay. Serves up right. Indeed. Huh, oh, actually, looks like we've got a couple more red level ups coming up. And then what do we want to do? Yellow? Yeah, maybe, actually. Yellow and blue are kind of lagging behind, I think. So where does that lead? Nowhere. Now the thing about this place is that, um... Okay, that was like the exact same fight. Anyway, like I was saying, the thing about this place is that just like the sewers beneath Valua, there's a... the exact same cool item, actually, that you can get for Drachma. So maybe we'll be a bit luckier this time. And I'm going back because it looks like uh, that was, in fact, the way forward, not this way. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah, that's kind of terrifying. Do I even bother fighting these loopers? I kind of don't want this to, uh, exist. So, how about we first of all switch over... What do I... Do we want blue? What is this thing? It's green. I don't know. Sure, let's work on blue. Why not? Oh, you're actually attacking. I'm surprised. Normally they run away. They're both sticking around. Huh. Well, I might just defeat them yet. We'll see how much damage this big bug can take. It has been silenced. I guess that's something Fina can do now. Yeah, have some of that. It did, and it lived, actually. Uh, Drachma, please. Oh, thank you. All right, well, then I guess we just see what happens with these guys. Miss. Part of me wants to see what those bugs can do just to have it on camera, but at the same time, eh, I'd rather not take unnecessary damage. And you, you are a pest. Okay, well, it's not gonna survive another Cutlass Fury. Over there. Oh, never mind, there it goes. See ya. We did it. And we got a Dexa Seed. I don't know what that does. I mean, it must, like, increase dexterity or something, maybe? Uh, what is this? 
Increases Agile by one. Well, we all know Drachma can probably use all the Agile he can get. So, yeah, there we go. What are you doing down here? I haven't seen you around here before. Were you brought here recently? A man named Deloco made this mine. It's filled with nasty traps. There are trapdoors all over the place. And remember, a circle doesn't always mean it's the right way. If you can see below, look down. If there's a mining cart, it'll come back here. Right. So all those traps, uh, if you take a wrong step, you wind up in the garbage. Okay, good to know. Now we move forward. Climbing back up all this way. Uh, no, don't step on the circles. They are, in fact, the wrong way. And back up here. So guess what the bats can do? They can use Super Sonic and confuse your characters. Yeah, even in completely different franchises, you can't escape Zubat. Oh, the door. Hmm. Now, what have we here? Okay, so we do actually have... Somewhere we have a Cham. Uh-huh. Somewhere in this room. Now, these... Those two will lead somewhere I don't want to go. I believe this doesn't lead anywhere, but I'm going to check. It does not. Okay. Good to know. Uh, but this one here should lead... Oh, I can just walk on it. <laughs> of course. Okay, Cupel. Now, where is it? I think it's here? Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, nothing to it. Fina, uh, how about you feed this hungry pet of yours another one of these chams? And it probably won't level up, but whatever, that's fine. Uh, what is down this way? We delve ever deeper into the mines. And now we have doors. Now, I swear there are actual Valuan enemies in these mines. It's not all bats and bugs. Uh, what is this? This is a treasure chest that contains Curia crystals. Well, I would rather have them than not have them, I suppose. Uh, more cells. What do we got? Uh, 800 gold? I'll take it. Don't mind if I do. And further down we go. And this... Ooh, this is another trap room. Uh... I think this one actually has a trick to it. Hmm. Because over this way... Yeah, the O's go through, but this one, I... I think leads to a treasure chest, so let's see what happens. Ah! Yes. What do we got? Give me something good. Deloco mail. Oh, we get to read his mail? No. That was a bad joke. Uh, it is, in fact, mail as in armor. Uh, is it good? A suit of armor crafted by Deloco designed to... Protect from enemy attacks. Yes, that is what typically one designs armor to do. Anything else here? No? Okay, so I'm going back down. And I'm gonna have to go through all that again, aren't I? Aren't I? Hey, Vice, having fun? Oof. Yeah, here we are in the trash. Okay. So, uh, I will be right back. Okay, here I am. I'm back here again. So, let's, let's take a look. So this, this is, I think, the right way to go. Oh yeah, it's an X. It'll lead me right over. 
But where does this other one lead? There's stuff over there. Two loopers, that's it. That was a weird fight. So where does this lead? This leads down. And then that itself... Oh, there's another treasure chest down there. Huh. Okay, I bet that's how you get there. Alright, we go exploring. So, what is this? Uh, there are no other doors. Just three triangles. Okay, and they lead where? Uh, that one leads to a cart. That one leads to a cart. This one does not lead to a cart? No, I don't think it does. No, I can walk here. Very cool. Okay, then. So what is this way? Uh, oh, we've got more cells. Okay. Uh, oh. Hello. Sorry to barge in, captured man. Hmm? You don't look like you're a Valuan. Who might you be? I'm Vice. Are you Isapa? Uh, no, it appears you have mistaken me for someone else. My name is Centim. Ah, so this is the famous Centim. Oh, then you're Hans's father. Oh, you know Hans? Then you must have been to the village in Hortica. That's where my wife and children are. Everyone was okay, right? Yeah, they were doing just fine. But you should probably worry about yourself right now. Oh, I'm okay. When I refused to help Valua, they threw me into these dungeons. I've been in here for quite a while. You are looking for someone named Asapa, correct? If so, you'll need to venture further into these mines. I, I think I can help. Oh, can you now? Can you get the elevators working? There are elevators scattered throughout the mines. You will need to use them to reach the other areas. I can get them working. A brilliant engineer, they said. And I guess he lives up to his name. Ah, we have power. Woohoo! Wow, Centim, you're amazing! Oh, why, thank you. I must advise you, proceed with caution. There are all sorts of traps. I will travel ahead and see if I can disarm them for you. Well, that would be helpful. Thank you. You've been a great help to us already. It's the least I can do. You rescued me, remember? I'm sure we'll meet again. Good luck. Huh. So I guess that was actually the way I had to go. Uh, oh. And that is also the only cell. There's nothing else in here, is there? There's no, like, save spot? Nah. Okay, where does the elevator take us? Going up. Huh, well, we've got another cell. Uh, who is in this one, if anybody? Uh, no, only a treasure chest, a Zal seed. Wow, good thing they keep these chests locked up in prison cells. Kind of odd. Uh, no, not super move, darn it. Uh, items. I always go down to super move. Why do I do that? Well, now I have two of these. Increases vigor. I feel like vigor is like defense, maybe. Here, Fina, you can have some, Ika can have some, and we're good. And, oh, a fork in the road. Oh, hello! We have some new enemies, diggers. So we've got some uh, Valuan mining equipment, it looks like. Can I do anything about these things? Uh, no, you know what, we should probably concentrate our firepower on one of them. They look like they probably have a little bit more health than the bats did. 
Oh, look at them shuffling around. They're kind of cute, actually. Oh, they don't have that much more health than the bats. Well, see how they like an Alpha Storm. Oh, one of them must be blocking. Oh! Okay. Ugh, bonk. Oh, counterattack. Nice. Take that. And just bash through another one. Yeah, there you go. Okay, Vice. Oh, yeah, you can probably take that one down. And everyone else can concentrate on the other. And we should be good to go. So I get the impression that these are probably the enemies that I want to hunt down if I want Drachma's weapon. I mean, there's, there were four of them here. Maybe I'll get lucky. Is it over already? It is over already, Vice. No, nothing. Again, uh, enemies drop weapons extremely rarely. Where the heck am I? Oh, look, Valuan guards, and they got the drop on us. Mm, that's unfortunate. I don't like taking free damage. Oh, but they're not super powerful, and it looks like one of them was just guarding during a surprise attack. Uh, yeah, whatever. We can attack you, you can attack that one, you can attack the injured one. And there we go. What happens? Ah, you're still guarding. Stop that. <clears throat> Oof. And the counterattack, of course. Ah, oh, too fast for you. There we go. That takes care of one of them. Okay, Vice, you know what? I've had enough of these guys. Just, uh, use the special. Probably should have done that all along, really. Bonk. And one more! Out of there! Yeah, that's probably more than his maximum HP. We did it! We did it. Now, drop a cool item, please. Well, they dropped a Glyph of Might. Uh, I don't think those are good. I think it's like an X attack in Pokemon. Oh, uh, no, this leads down. The heck? All right, well, whatever you say, game. Now, this looks like somewhere I've already been according to the map. Uh, oh, it's not, though. It's this way. Ah, uh, ha, ha, I see. And that chest I already got. What is that ladder? I don't know. It appears to lead nowhere. It's a trap. A trap meant to waste your time. Oh, hey, Deloco. <laughs> good, good. Soon, Vice, very soon, you shall die. And when you die, I want you to die slowly. Yes, slowly, really slowly. I want your brains to gush out of your head. That's very pleasant, Deloco. Oh, pardon me, Deloco. I didn't mean to interrupt one of your intellectual monologues. I came to tell you that Vice has broken into the mines. Oh, how astute of you, Alfonso. <laughs> and you figured this out all by yourself. What gave it away? Was it the alarm? Maybe the sirens? 
Yes, well, the fact that he was foolish enough to deliver himself to me, I shall go dispose of him. All right, see you later. <laughs> you are the fool, Alfonso. Got him. <laughs> the only reason that you are made admiral was because of your family. You don't stand a chance against vice. I shall kill him. I want him to die, die, die. Soon, very soon. <laughs> okay, DeLoco. Be that as it may, uh, I'm going this way. And... Oh, hey. So those two are guarding something. Oh. I see. Does this count as a plot-relevant battle? I guess so. We'll leave it in, just for you. Now, how many of them are there? Four? Okay, that's not bad. I can deal with four. And I don't think I can hit multiple at once with Ika, so... Let's just do that and see how this goes. Cutlass Fury? Nothing to it. Ooh, and now they're lined up nicely. Blocking? Jerk. Wasting all my attacks. Ah, oh, well... I guess in the end, the result was the same. Oof. Ooh, counterattack! Take that! What are you doing? Crystallis, they can use magic! Mmm, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, that did a little damage, actually. Uh-huh. Well, I know that Vice can take them down in one hit, so... This should be fine. And you blocked! You know what? I give you credit for trying. Is it over already? Yeah, it's over already. Okay, Drachma slowly gaining magic. And now we've got to check every single room. Because there's got to be something good, right? Uh, a Glyph of Might. Four of them, in fact. Uh, those aren't good. How about this one? A Glyph of Speed. Okay. Uh, also, not what I'm looking for. How about this one? A uh, healing salve. Okay, so we're just getting all of DeLoco's weird little item buffs. Ah, and you, I presume, are Isapa. And who might you be? Ah, uh, are you the High Priest, Isapa? The one and only I am Isapa. Uh, we're on a mission from King Ixataka. We're here to rescue you. Huh, well, the king knows what I like, sending two beautiful women to come save me. Ah, oh, there's gotta be one in every game, huh? I have no use for you men. Now, if you would just leave us alone for a while... Buddy, chill out. Oh, really, there's no way this dirty old man is a high priest. Yeah, you said it, Ika. Oh, aren't you a pretty one? In all my years, I have never seen anyone like you. I believe you are a Sylvite, am I right? Uh, what? How did you know? Ha <laughs> ha, instinct, my dear, instinct. I am very observant, especially around women. Buddy, please. I could probably guess that goofy girl's measurements. Okay, that does it. I know we have to bring him back, but the king didn't say anything about bringing him back conscious. You know what, Aika? That's a good idea. Relax, Aika. Right now, we just have to worry about getting out of here alive. Let's go. Oh, hey, DeLoco. So, you've rescued Isapa. Very nice. <laughs> but soon you will die. You will die a horrible death, and you will scream, and I will laugh. Oh, 
Oh, and he's opening the door for us. I've prepared my favorite room just for you. Please come in and stay a while. Stay forever. Ha 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 Ah, the one and only Deloco. So, uh, what is between here and there? Anything else? Anything worth noting? Oh, uh, well, there's another elevator, so I guess we'll take it. It leads up. And here, all right, well, this appears to be the boss door. And after a long, grueling dungeon like that, yeah. I think it's time we heal and save, and in the next episode, we will meet with whatever terrible, beastie, mechanical or otherwise, DeLoco has prepared for us. So, if you enjoyed this episode, then please leave a like, a comment, subscribe, and I do hope that you join me again next time for the next exciting episode of this. Till then, ta-ta.